Hello everyone, and welcome to Jumperman Tech, where we specialize in HVAC, but do everything DIY. And today, I'm going to bring this robot that I built from scratch to life with sound, as we have speakers for eyes. Thank you to everyone tuning in to Jumperman Tech. And I just wanted to give everyone a better look at the robot that I built. So the frame is made out of wood. And it's made out of a whole bunch of old computer parts and random junk. We have eyes, which are speakers. And my idea here was to bring this to life with sound. So what I have is an amplifier board, which works with Bluetooth. So I want to give this power, run the wires to the speakers. And let's see if we can make this come alive with sound. So here's a quick look at the tools and materials we're going to use for this project starting from the left. We have a cordless soldering iron, a wire stripper, a precision screwdriver, solder, super glue, wire, our amplifier board. We need a power supply and that there is a, is a holder with a switch that can hold a 9 volt battery and it can plug right into our amplifier board. And this board is good from 8 to 25 volts. To further understand our project, I'm going to go over the amplifier board. So starting with our top left, this is our Bluetooth antenna. Here we have a set of Bluetooth indicator lights. If we look closely here, we have two little switches. These are dip switches, and this can adjust our decibel levels. Uh, we have a number of buttons, starting from the left. This is our play button. This is our previous button, our next button. This is volume up, and this is volume down. And if we turn the board to the right, this right here is our power supply. And this is a 2.1 millimeter interface, good for 8 to 25 volts DC. And down over here is how we connect our speakers. Starting from the left, this is our right negative, right positive. And this is our left negative and our left positive. So here's a back view of the robot. And I'm just going to super glue the amplifier board in the top left corner. Here's our power supply. As you can see, we have an on and off switch. I'm going to insert the battery and glue this onto our robot. Now I'm just going to glue it right over here. Our power supply is now mounted in place. And now we're going to cut down our wire down to size and we're going to run four wires from the speakers to the amp. There's a close-up view of the speaker. If you can see, it is labeled as positive and negative. I cut my wires down to size and I will use the red as positive and black to represent negative. And we're just going to match up the speakers with the amplifier. So I'll use this as my right speaker because this is facing backwards. This is my right speaker, positive and negative, and match it up with my right speaker on the amp, positive and negative. To make our connection at the board, just strip your wire back, slide it into the port, take your screwdriver, and lock it down. Now you have a snug connection. As far as the speakers, these connections must be soldered. There is already some residue of solder and wire from the past. So I just wrap my wire around that connection right there. I would advise to put some soldering flux on that connection and then solder.
Here are the instructions on how to pair your device. Pause the video so you can get a better look. Alright, I'm going to flip the switch and see what happens. That does not sound good. Has to be our controller is overpowering our speakers, but let's see. I'm gonna hook up the Bluetooth and uh, let's see how this works. When we see that red and blue flash, that means we're ready for pairing. We are officially connected. Now it's the moment of truth. All right, everyone, moment of truth. All right. We can change our volume with our phone or on the controller. This is a very small speaker compared to what the controller can handle, so you can only put the volume up so much, but we are in operation. If anybody found this video interesting or helpful, please drop a like, comment, and subscribe. I'll catch you guys next time.